Hello everyone. I am Ranjit from Informatica Global Customer Support. In this video, we will see how to perform the connection assignment in CDGC. The agenda of today's session is what is connection assignment? What are all the types of connection scans in CDGC? And then we will see on the steps to perform the connection assignment and connection unassignment along with a quick demo. What is connection assignment? Assigning a connection to reference catalog source involves assigning connections from the reference catalog source to the catalog source that represents the source system. Assign connections for the reference catalog sources to link the reference assets to the actual objects in the source system and to view complete lineage. Before you assign connections, configure the catalog source for the reference source system. And then you can assign the connections between the reference catalog source and the configured catalog source. After you assign the connections to reference catalog sources, you can view the complete lineage including actual assets from the source that you configured the connections to. If you had enriched reference assets with the business terms, the terms are associated with the catalog source after connection assignment. Types of connection scans. The first one is connectionless scan. Connectionless scans are performed without connection assignment. Uh, and they generate incomplete or inaccurate lineage based on the predictions of what the repository might be instead of actual details that a connection to the database provides. You can run connectionless scans to identify preliminary configuration issues. Connection aware scan. Connection aware scans retrieve the exact database information into the repository. This database information is then used to derive the complete and accurate column level lineage for source systems that includes store procedures and select store SQL statements. Connection aware scan is supported for the following catalog sources. The sources are Informatica Intelligent Cloud Services, Informatica Power Center, Microsoft Azure Data Factory, Microsoft SQL Server Integration Services, Databricks and AWS Glue. Steps to perform the connection aware scan. To perform connection aware scans, perform the following tasks. Create the catalog source and run the catalog source job. Assign connections or database schemas to the respective catalog sources. For example, if you have connection to your source Oracle database and your target Teradata data warehouse, assign both source and target connections to the catalog sources that represent the databases. If you do not assign a connection to the catalog source, then the catalog source is a referenced catalog source. Run the catalog source job again. Now we will see on the steps to perform the connection assignment and connection unassignment along with a quick demo. Here I have already created the power center resource and MS SQL resource. In power center mapping, I have used both source and target as SQL tables. So this is the power center resource and I searched which this in data governance and catalog. So this is the session we have created. In this one we could see like the data is moving from repro KB source to repro KB target via this uh, repro test mapping. So now we could see this both repro KB source and repro KB target are reference assets. So when we are hovering on the object we could see this, this is a reference asset. So now we will try to do the connection assignment and see the object. And this is the MS SQL resource which we have created and we could see that both this repro KB source and repro KB target are extracted as part of this extraction. So now I am, now I am searching with this connection name repro connection in metadata command center monitor connection assignment. So here we could see the parent catalog sources repro power center which we have created in So 
so now I am uh, now I am assigning the connection so I am using the filter endpoint and in endpoint I am giving the exact SQL catalog source name so here I am assigning the connection on DB level and click assign so this will trigger a connection assignment job and we will wait for the job for completion now we could see the job has been completed successfully so when we click on merge operation and click on properties we could see what is the SQL resource that we have assigned and what are all the properties we have given and when we click on this connection assignment task we could see that how much reference assets are present in the power center resource and how much got matched so now we navigate to data connection catalog and we will refresh this session so here now we could see like the the power center mapping is receiving the data from repro kb source and loading the table repro kb target so now we could see this reference assets got transformed into the actual source system that is micro, uh, microsoft sql server source system now if we are required to do the connection and un assignment and see the earlier how how the reference assets looks like so in order to do that navigate to metadata command center monitor connection assignment page so here we could see this job is completed successfully and 100 percentage match is found so here to in order to perform the connection un assignment so click on these three dots and click on un assign this will trigger the connection unassignment job so now we could see the connection unassignment job completed successfully so now i am navigating to data governance and catalog I am, and i am referencing this session now the assets gets reverted into the reference catalog source we would love to hear feedback from you thanks for watching